Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, I'm Josh. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, turn on the post notifications because we post videos every single Sunday. So as you guys can tell from the title and the thumbnail, I'm gonna be surprising Kagali on Valentine's Day. So what I'm gonna be doing, what I have planned is, right now I'm packing up because I'm gonna be going to the hotel. That's right, I got ourselves a hotel. I'm gonna go check in, gonna bring our stuff. And then after that, we have reservations tonight at a very fancy restaurant. So make sure you guys stay the entire length of the video to check out her reaction. She's also got like a little surprise for me too, which she told me about, so make sure you guys watch that reaction as well. Um, so right now I'm just gonna have everything laid out on the bed. I'm just gonna set the camera up, I'm gonna start packing, and then we're gonna be on our way. All right guys, I think I got everything laid out on the bed, ready to be packed, and then I'm gonna pack it, put it in my trunk of my car, and I'm gonna drive over to um, our destination. All right guys, so just got to the hotel. I got the keys. Um, yes, like I said, we're at a hotel. So we're spending the night at a hotel. We still are in the same town. We're like really close to home. Um, but I just wanted to like get a little, you know, like a little getaway just for a night, um, a little staycation to get our minds off things and everything. Um, I still have everything in the car. I'm gonna go bring it in right after this. Um, so I just wanted to come on here and just talk to you guys about how I feel about Karadi and just, you know, just talk from the heart. Speak from the heart. All right, so like I said in the last video, I, I know how gorgeous this woman is. She is she is the prettiest woman in the world, and I mean that. I do mean that. And before we started dating, because Kagari is my first relationship, but before I we started dating, I was always I'm always been picky with um, just like people that I even am friends with, people that I'm close to. Um, but for some reason, when Kagari and I first started hanging out. Even just started texting, it just clicked like right away. And just ever since then, I just knew, I and I know it's cliche to say, but I knew since the beginning that she is the person I wanted to spend the rest of my life with. I didn't, I knew I was in love with her um, within the first few weeks of us getting to know each other. Um, but I knew she was gonna be my long, my like my long lasting best friend um, just from the very first moment we met. And and I think that's why that's that's I think that's why like I have the courage and and just the and I want to do all this stuff you know like I want to come and do this stuff I want to come and I do all this stuff for Kagari like because I I genuinely enjoy it I love spoiling this girl I I'm not the kind of person to go and splurge on myself but I love just doing anything and everything I can for this specific person and and i'm happy and i'm beyond thankful for her to be my person it is it's 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 literally a privilege to have someone like that and i know it is um, a one in a lifetime kind of love and it's very rare and we were luckily luckily lucky enough to find ourselves at a younger age like we've been well we've known each other since um like 10th grade so we were about 15 years old maybe 16 years old and we've been together since I was 17, she was 16. So it's, it's a little, almost coming up on three years now that we've been together and not one moment have we like gone to the point, we hardly even fight, we just, we get along through everything. We have the same interests, the same dreams. And I think that's what made me fall in love with her after those first few weeks was that everything that I said, she got. Everything that she said, I got. It was just, it was easy, it wasn't, it's it's never been a job. It's never been hard to love this woman. It just comes so easy. And like I said, that is why I love doing this stuff for her. So today is a day of love, but it's for my baby. We're gonna do whatever she wants. Just relax. There's a pool here. Um, I brought some games and some drinks, obviously, and just I don't know, just whatever she wants to do. Even if she wants to go out on the town, whatever. We're we are in the heart of downtown, so. Maybe she wants to go out. Um, but like you guys seen in the um, in like the packing little clip, I brought her like um, like a swimsuit because of the uh, the pool, and then I also brought her like some gym outfits because the gym that we work out at is 
in the same building as this <laughs> this hotel. So um, yeah, so it's pretty cool. I mean, tomorrow morning we're I'm hoping maybe we'll go hit a workout. Um, but yeah, anyway, so enough of my chit chat. Uh, let's get back to the video. But again, I just want to say how much I love love this woman, and that is not just words. That is a deep feeling that. Like I said, I'm beyond grateful to be feeling. Let's get back into it. All right, we're gonna do a quick little room tour. I'm finally in the room. It took a while to get here, but we made it. Um, so first things first is obviously the bathroom. Nothing too crazy. Nice mirror, shower, bathtub. And then you come over here, nice TV, queen size bed, little office area. Decent view. And then over here, I got this set up for me and my girl. I brought this home, brought this from home. So that way when she comes in, she gets greeted from some nice drinks. And then I also did get her a little bit of a gift. It's not much, there's only one gift. Um, the hotel and then I'm also taking her out to dinner. So that's, I'd say that's a gift on its own. Um, but I did want to get her one object. So here it is. So I got her the New Balance 574. She's been hyping these up for a while. She's been talking about this since like before her birthday. So I really hope she likes them. I think she's going to like them. And uh, anyways, that's it for the hotel. Let's go pick my baby up and then pick it up from there. Hey guys, it's me. Josh just picked me up and I don't know what's going on. But I'm all ready. Are you excited? Yes, but I'm freaking out because he's so confusing. I keep thinking of something and then it's not what I think it is. And then it's just, I'm freaking out. So as of now, you have no idea? Not really. Like, I, I think of things, but I don't actually know if it's that. Actually, there's nothing that I know for sure. I've been telling Karali that I've had something planned for about three weeks now. Yeah. About a month. So this is it. This is it, babe. I'm nervous. Well, we will catch back up with you guys when we get there. We are here! What the hell? <laughs> what is this? You didn't, you, know, you didn't think this was it? No, I mean, I didn't think about it, but then when you told me we're going to eat, I was like, oh. Ah, here you go. Because you had mentioned months ago that there was like this fancy restaurant where you used to work. This was like months ago. I used to work like right in the same courtyard, so we're here. So I thought of it, but like I, I really didn't. But we got to go because we're 10 minutes late to our reservation. Are so you I'm told there was no Let's rush. go, let's go. Okay, Look at this beautiful lady. It's a, how many course meal? It's like a, it's a four course meal. You get appetizer, and then a meal, and then another meal, and then a dessert. Yeah. And it's like fancy, like I, did, I couldn't really have it. And look, we even get little yeah. kisses. And we have that option for flat or sparkling water. Yeah, I love that. Yeah, they just came and gave us like this fancy bread, and then they poured olive oil and balsamic and vinegar in our plates. Like, what is this? Like, what is this? We got our appetizers. Dude, look at this. Like, what is that? That's meat. I don't get it, but it tastes good, so. This is a shrimp on this. Whatever that is, and they put brandy in it. You can't even bottle of brandy. Like, what? So, this is our second. This is our first meal. We got the yeah. and this is our first yeah. meal, so this is crazy. The second course. Hopefully this one's I got steak with potatoes and mushrooms. And you got lamb. Lamb with asparagus. Looks so good. Dessert has arrived. I got dark chocolate cheesecake. Strawberry banana tiramisu. Dude, that shit looks so good. That's really nice. Alright, we're going to the gym. That's what it looks like. Yeah. <laughs> what the hell? Are we going to the movies? Oh, bottom note. 
That was such a good supper. Oh my god, guys. That shit was, was fire, like, bro. That was the fanciest supper I've ever been to. It was fancier than I thought it was gonna be in Oregon. Like, life. that was crazy. I was like, what the hell? I don't deserve this. But yes, you do. And now we're in a parking garage, and I'm confused. They already know why. Okay, well, you guys are confused, but I'm confused on what's going on. So, can you tell me what's going on? What? It's the uh, room key. No way. <laughs> hey, that's my own. Oh, yes, my own. You freaking. Yup. No way. Alright, let's get in there. What the hell? Guys, Josh just went back down to the lobby because we're on the top floor and both of our room keys are not working. He was here earlier and he said that it was working, but now they're not. So he went down to the lobby and I'm just chilling by the door with our stuff, waiting. But I just, since I'm not with him, it's probably the only time tonight that I'm not gonna be with him. I just wanted to say thank you. Like supper was literally like so fun, incredible, like such an experience, like that fancy stuff is not necessarily me, but it was such like an experience and I would never take it back. And I can't believe he thought of that and even did that for me. Now, I know he's been planning this for a while, so it's just, I don't know, I feel like I don't deserve him today. And then I thought, I don't know, I didn't think he was going to get a hotel room, too. And then he told me to film my reaction going into the room, so I don't even know what to expect now. But I just, I'm beyond thankful for him. And I, I just, oh my god, I'm actually speechless right now. Like, this is such an amazing night. It's a Wednesday, and it feels like a Saturday. I'm kind of scared I'm filming right now, honestly, because... I'm alone on the top floor of a hotel and I'm kind of scared of elevators. So if ever something happened and I needed to go down by myself, I'd kind of be scared. I'm kind of filming just in case something happens to me. So it's just making me feel safer. I feel like I'm not alone. I got the JC fam with me. What up? And I know Josh did all of this for me and it's like so amazing and I knew he was planning it so I didn't put any effort into planning anything normally I do. But I did kind of spoil him with gifts for Valentine's. Kind of went a little bit overboard, but it's okay. He deserves it, especially after doing all of this. It's just crazy. That's the least I could do. So I'm going to be doing like a cute little setup. I got like quite a bit of gifts for him. I don't know what the room looks like, but I'm going to be setting it up. I'm going to tell him to go to the bathroom. So just stay tuned for that. He's leaving me. He's laughing. <laughs> he got up here. And apparently they put the keys through like the scanner thing and they're still not working so he's going back down. So this is not going well but and I'm really standing in heels. Loki kind of in pain but I'm a trooper. I could like pretend I'm like in Jamaica right now and it would make sense in my head. Dude and I think there's a pool here. I think he packed me a swimsuit and then he's bullshitting that we're gonna go back home to get them. I think he packed me an overnight bag because that would have been the smart thing to do. I taught him right, I think. But, ah, guys, I don't know what's happening. And again, <laughs> he's not happy. Um, third time, <laughs> he just came back up. So last time they just scanned it to like make sure it's like the right key for the right room. Didn't work, went back down, and then they gave him new cards. And now it still doesn't work, so he went back down a third time. I was like, dude, just fucking tell the guy to come open the door. Like, <sighs> damn, I thought my anxiety was over. Update, um, I guess third time is not a charm. They, I think, gave him new cards again, and they said that if it didn't work again this time, then they were gonna come and open it themselves. So Josh just went back down for the fourth fucking time. This is absolutely crazy. I'm like, dude. Tell him that we should get a discount on our room. Like, dude, my feet are killing me. And I think the pool closes, like, I don't know what time. Usually, like, 9 or 10, and it's already, like, quarter after 8. So, better boogie. And we gotta do, like, the gifts and everything first. Well, I might do it after. We're running out of time, but still, this is absolutely crazy. Everything was going great until this. Alright, here's the scoop. Fifth time, the guy went up. I told him the guy was maybe coming up. That's all I say now. He came and tried it. It's not working at all. So now their solution is that they might have to bust on the door. No, he came up. It didn't work. 
and then he went back down and got another type of key still didn't work and so now he's trying to get managers to answer because they might have to bust down our door and they're going to give us another room in the meantime and their solution yeah, is to give us another room and you guys already know what's in this room so it's going to be awkward if that's the bust down the door <laughs> I'm so mad. So I really don't think we're making it to the pool tonight. It's already, what time is it? Like, it's currently 8, 18. Uh, I told them We've been here for about, what, maybe 30 minutes now? Yeah, half an hour, and we can't get in our room. And we still can't get in. So this might. <sighs> this is such a fucking fuck up, dude. So we better get a discount or a free stay, because this is crazy. Better get a fucking 100% discount. <laughs> Little update, they just gave us the room beside us. Like right next door. Oh. So it's currently like 8.20, and he said if they haven't called by 9, then we will call them again. So hopefully we can get our room open even tonight, but we have important stuff in there. Like, dude, I'm so... I'm so... I'm trying to keep calm because it's Valentine's, and I don't want to ruin it. Mm -hmm. It is frustrating, like even for me. So it really sucks. Anyway, so we do have a bottle of wine with us, so we might go. Oh fuck yeah! Do we have cups? There's cups right across the hallway. So we're gonna go get a little drink on. Because uh, this is just. Before Josh fucking loses it. <laughs> I swear! I swear! Right now, I I better be getting this hotel for free. I better be getting this hotel, this fucking room for free. Yeah, like actually. No. If not, like I I. At least a hundred dollars. The guy is pretty nice about it though, and it's not his fault. He was really gonna give us a room with like a king size bed, like an upgrade of our room, like just to stay in. But it was too far to move all our stuff because we were just standing in the hallway. So he gave us the one right beside. Which I can't complain too much about. I'd rather like be right next to it. Yeah, because it's not like we need a bed because we better not be sleeping in this room tonight. <laughs> I swear. All right, let's go get our drink on. All right, guys. We're actually staying in the other room. So Josh had to move his whole setup from my first room to this one while I'm locked in the bathroom. So now this is me blagging. Hold on, hold on. Oh boy, what a night. Alright, come on in. No way. No, you did not. No, you did not. Babe, no you didn't. <laughs> oh my god, no you didn't. <laughs> That's not it. And then, look on the table. On the table. Oh my goodness. I had another bottle of wine here. I figured because you grabbed that one yeah. and I was like, mm, he definitely already brought the other one. Mm -hmm. show, the, show the viewers no, what I got you. No he did not. No he did not. And? He got me freaking New Balances. The seven, or the 574. And then you can't show this on camera, but I hope. And we got some beverages. It's Mr. Uh, dude, I was not expecting that. It is man. Dude, what the heck? Dude, these are so nice. I like, know. you can't tell me these are not nice. Those are fresh. Like, these are so nice. Those have been in my car for so long. Like, those will be nice with, like, just, like, any fit. Like, running shoes yeah, to just wear. Gym, but... mm. Well, I was gonna use them just for outfits. That's why. Oh, and also, I don't know if you realize, but I actually packed you a bag and everything, and myself a bag. Yeah, I figured. You figured when I you were looking for your bag. didn't say anything. Yeah, and then, uh, yeah, I'll tell you some stories after. <laughs> okay, Kareli jumped quick on the hop, but she's already trying yeah, them they on. They fit like a fucking glove. They were made for me, but. <laughs> um, <laughs> Look at this fit. Okay, definitely not with this dress, but. Ooh. Dude, I feel like New Balances just look so clean. Cause I don't have running shoes. They're just sleek. Like everyday running shoes. Yeah, they're fresh. Like the, these with like jeans. Mm-hmm. Girl. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. No, you did not. Yes, ma'am. Fuck, bro. I can't top this. I can't top this. Yes, okay, guys, it's now my turn to do my setup. So, let's do this. What the fuck? No, you. 
you did not, bro. It's quite Dude, this <laughs> what the fuck? Dude, no. No, you did not. Are you serious? This is a presentation, y'all. I'm making sure it all match together. It's like gold and sparkly. Wow. I was obsessed with this bag. Ooh, we gotta keep all these bags. Yeah. Okay. Starting off with the card. Oh my god, dude, you're about to make me cry. This is all I need. I hope you know that. This is all I need. You're literally making me tear up. Jesus. <laughs> Are you ready? I gotta kind of like, undo this to like, give you them in the fourth I gotta know, like, where'd you buy all this stuff? So this is the next gift? Yeah. This big one? Mm -hmm. Is there a reason why there's this specific order? Or? Not really, it's just like... Okay, this it's is totally... It's healthy snacks. Like, yeah, I was gonna say. It's all like healthier options. Is this like a five hour it's like, energy? It's a like pre workout thing. Sports energy performance. Yeah, just take it before the gym. I don't know. There's different flavors, but I was like, try it and see like if it even does. I'm a fan of bro. Grocery snacks. For real. See, I'm a, I, and I love I snacks. snacks. Yeah. I, there's You're something. always snacking. I was I'm like, that's not snacking. a waste of money. Yeah. So I'm like, you gonna spend it. In. Yeah, exactly. I'm always snacking, and I've been trying to find healthy substitute, substitutes. Yeah, for like So, yeah. this is great. Thank you so much. Just go open. Another cute bag. These bags are so cute. See, so that one's practical. Again, there's two things. <laughs> They're magnesium. Oh, no way. Salts. And there's magnesium, so it's like a recovery for like your muscles after the gym. Oh, no way. It's bath salts. And it's men's. Yeah, men's bath salts. And one thing about me is, I'm a guy, I probably already said this before, but I'm a guy, but I love taking baths. Yeah. And I'm proud of it. I don't care. Um, well, I see damn, we got that magnesium. magnesium. Oh, so, and peppermint, like, uh, cool. Yeah, ultra recovery for like your muscles after the gym. Blow it. Oh, no way! It's for guys. No way, men pimple patches. Yeah, that's awesome. That, you want that is awesome. I seen the guy one, but then I got Dude, that is so cool. It's almost like kind of like self care. A little bit of self care. I love that. Another one, but with red hearts. Oh. Again, now they're the A book? No freaking. No, you did not, bro. See what I mean? You did not. Nice not. No way. Did I mention this so long ago to you? That's okay, baby. Another. Oh, you gotta kiss him. This is the cutest bag of all. I know. It's got like a heart on the handle. That's the first bag I picked out. I was like, okay, now I gotta match all the other ones. That's so cute. What is this? It's cologne, but smell it. Why? And I just thought it looked cool. <laughs> Ooh, that is smells good. Oh God, it's eau de toilette, perfect. Mm -hmm. It smells good. Mm. And yeah. the, fa the fancy bottle, I was like. If you like it, then I'm gonna wear it. I like it. Good. Give me another. Okay, you get to pick now because I don't know. The small bottle. Are they gonna kiss on them yet? Guess what it is. I'm gonna go ahead and guess okay. a flask. Okay. Cause I've been saying that anymore. It's either that or jewelry. Oh shit. Oh okay. shit. Show the camera. I've been wanting to get into my jewelry grind. Dude, I'll be able to match you. Yeah, I wow. I just hope it doesn't fit you. I'll try it on right now. That is such a nice fucking drive. See, like, this is things that, like... You would never get yourself. Yeah, I would never get myself. And I'm so happy that you're the kind of... Like, you're so good at getting gifts. And I'm so happy that you are. It's it nice. really just fits. Yo, that's so Dude, that nice. looks so good. Dude. I love that. Oh, if the light will focus. Look at that. It's so nice. It's called Blackjack. Damn, thank you, girl. Okay, okay, okay. Yes, Jack. 
boxer. I know how much this is. I knew how, and, it, and the reason why I wanted this specific one. If you one, guys haven't seen our Christmas gift opening video, I got him shoes that match exactly the hat. And I have a hoodie that I actually have here. Yeah. That is the same green as well. And you guys are It's just that. so nice. And Dude. I knew how it's all the like. Was this before or after I bought this one? And I know how much this hat is, and I probably never would have bought it for myself, so. Damn. But I, I was upset with it. It touched you the matches with your shoes, so they do nothing. It looks so sick. You like it? Yeah, look at your shoes. Yes, ma'am. Okay, now. <laughs> Is this the, the grand finale? Well, it's not. It's not it, it's, I, I didn't go like by order like best. To, like, this is not really best. Well, I don't know. You could say whatever you want, but. I thought the bracelet was. I oh, yeah. bracelet and, and the hat. I like them all. Yeah, just open that one. Don't guess it. I made so much investments. When did you buy this? Like that. That was like, like quite a while ago. All right. Well, this is gonna be kind of a. You are one of a kind. I hope you know that. <laughs> oh, that's fresh. Dude, you did that. Come here. You really just made this feel like Christmas. <laughs> All right, so we just put on our comfy clothes and we are now having some drinks playing skip bow. So we went to take a walk to go look at the pool and there's a few couples in there and they closed in an hour anyways, so I don't know. Wasn't really feeling it. So we're, well, we might still go. But we might. Or in the morning, I don't know. But anyways, we're not swimming right now. We still got an hour if we want to. And then we went to go. I was maybe gonna order deep fried pickles or continue poppers because There's that supper was good, but it like it just filled me up enough. Like it so I'm already hungry again. And it's closed. So yeah, now I'm eating snacks that Josh brought. Thank God. So we got some chips. Oh, that's the vibe right now. Mm -hmm. So I don't know, we might just do this, get tired and go to bed. Or we might go crazy. Never know. We might head up to downtown. Yep. <laughs> Good morning guys. Good morning. <laughs> so we ended up like playing a few board games and then I got really tired. So <laughs> we went to bed like I don't know what time. Like midnight? Yeah, it was not late at all. Went to bed at like midnight and yeah, we woke up like well I've been up really early but we actually just got out of bed like half an hour ago and then we kind of started packing up our stuff a little bit, made the bed. So now we're going to go get breakfast because it, was too late. it closes in 40 minutes. So we're going to go get breakfast. Breakfast. They don't have any green cheese. Mm -hmm. Okay, I got these stuff in butter. Well, this is it, guys. Got all the stuff packed up. On the car. Ready to go. Sadly. It's actually really sad. <coughs> now we gotta go back to reality. I just realized we're matching. We are? Aww. Cute. Not the pants. <laughs> what do you think? Mm, I loved it. You sure? Mm -hmm. Next year is going to be bigger and better. I'm not in the frame. Mm. <laughs> no. Do you show them the little view we have? It's snowing. No. It's actually like a pretty cute view. It has like the little like... You gotta change the exposure. No, that's good. Like the little fence and then there's like the church. And the, <laughs> the church bells were ringing this last night and this morning. It's pretty cute. Yeah. You ready? Yes. Anywhere. All right, guys. We are now in the car. We're pretty much almost home. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and we're gonna close out today's video. Yeah. I don't want this video to end. <laughs> if you guys love this video, make sure you guys comment down below, share the video, hit that like button, comment down below, subscribe. Yeah, and comment down below heart emoji, red heart emoji, just to say that you made it to the end of the video. 
All right, we will see you guys in the next one. Bye.